Hello, YouTube. This could, <clears throat> I guess, be part four of the Wabash Electro Flash. Um, just if you need more info on it, you can see the uh, other videos. There's the uh, flash and there's another tube photo multiplier. I don't really know. Light bulb. Uh, anyway, I've, this thing is terrifying. I, I discharged it the other night. Uh, it was really scary, man. It, it, it throws an arc. Anyway, so I've got it plugged into a power strip here where I can turn it off and uh, not be touching anything. It is off there. Let me move this wire over here. The wire's okay. No shorts. It, it looks kind of uh, bad, but there's no shorts in it. It does work. And I've got a piece of, uh, I've done a bunch of plumbing, construction work, electrical, whatever. Electrical work. This is a, a PEX pipe, which is a polyethylene, cross-linked polyethylene tubing. It's non-conductive. It's dry. And I'm going to demonstrate the, uh, the uh, capacitor discharge switch there when you pull it out of the case it um, that little bar there will touch the other side of the capacitor I guess the anode and uh, it will uh, discharge its juice so it does work it's never been worked on those are um, <clears throat> I looked it up 2x uh, 2a rectifier Sylvania there um, this is a monster oil fill capacitor Yes, it is. Um, monster. And there's a little capacitor there. <clears throat> Not sure what that one does, but it's the, the one of the taps on that uh, Stockwell transformer there um, is 900 volts. So this thing is scary, okay? Um, pretty neat. Those are... Uh, they call it uh, China, vitreous China, wh whatever the word. I, I can't think of it anyway. A lot of pots and selector switches are made out of that stuff, the good, the good old stuff. But uh, anyway, I'm going to uh, charge it up. I'm a little nervous. I'm sorry. This thing scares me, man. So uh, and I guess it should to keep me safe, but I've got it on these two wooden planks here on this uh, little raggedy workbench, and uh, I'm nowhere near it. N none of my family is in this room. As you can see, this is kind of a multi-purpose room here. And I'm going to turn it on and charge this thing up and then uh, use this pipe to discharge it. It scared the hell out of me the other night. Um, so I'm going to cut this on first, uh, as we say in the south. And then go here. And as you can see, it fires up. The uh, tubes do glow. <clears throat> I don't want to get too close to this thing, but both of those uh, rectifiers there I've put on the old... Uh, tester here and then I've got another tester over there somewhere but uh, anyway I'm gonna let it charge for a minute and then I'm going to take this piece of pipe and uh, uh, discharge this thing hopefully without knocking it off the uh, the workbench but uh, this thing man my wife heard it five rooms away with the door shut the other day it is terrifying man that's why I'm a little scared right now uh, so let's see what happens here Jesus, that scares the hell out of me. I don't know if that came out loud on there. Oh my gosh, that is scary. <laughs> okay, I'm going to grab the uh, polyethylene pipe and do it one more time. Uh, just for your, uh, your electrical enjoyment, get a little closer. Let's see what happens. Whew! If it didn't come through loud on there, I'll tell you what, it's loud here. Okay, I'm done for the night. Gonna unplug this thing safely. In, in fact, I'll you can watch me do it, okay? I'm gonna turn this off first. Unplug this. And then we'll see that it's off. Oh my gosh, it's terrifying. And then we're gonna discharge it one more time and see if there's any juice in there. Oh yes. Alright. One more time. Alright, I'm still not gonna touch it. I'm going to put it back in its case, and I don't think I'm going to plug it in for a long time. Wow. Thanks, YouTube. Good night. Whew, I'm shaking. <laughs>